New here at 10, we are just two weeks away from Independence Day, the busiest time of the year for fireworks sales. Prices are actually down this year, but before you buy, Alexis Otis explains the warning from first responders while a statewide drought continues. Guys right here uh, are a new uh, package for us. It's fireworks season as we count down the days until July 4th. The Pipkin family was at Captain Jim's Fireworks in West Alton picking up items for Juneteenth. We're going to go make tacos and then pop fireworks. It's been a tough couple of years for the Myers family who've been in business for 76 years. A massive flood in 2019 followed by the pandemic and supply chain issues. Shipping prices got really, really expensive. Uh, shipping has come back down now and the supply chain has caught up. So our stock looks like normal again and we were able to lower prices across the board. They're keeping an eye on the skies to ensure weather doesn't derail another busy season. We've had much worse years in the past with the drought and uh, it looked like it could have gone that way, but we we have been getting some rain. 90% of Missouri counties are experiencing drought conditions. Right now, St. Charles County is in a moderate drought. A lot of what we see this time of year is a combination of either brush fires or fires that start on the roof. Fires like this one, where fireworks destroyed a Wentzville home last year. It's a challenge every summer, but Central County Fire in St. Charles County is preparing for drier conditions. If fireworks are legal where you live and you decide to shoot them off yourself, the fire departments are asking you to please do it safely, not only while you're setting them off, but after you're finished, and when you dispose of them. Put them in a metal bucket, cover them with water, douse them completely with water, and let them sit there overnight. Don't just put them into the plastic combustible garbage can that we all have sitting beside our house. If you're doing it in your backyard, just spray it down a little bit before you do it. That way you don't have any issues. The other safe way to celebrate? Leave it to the professionals. Alexis Zotos, News 4. And just remember, fireworks are illegal in many areas. St. Louis City and County don't allow them. The state of Illinois bans most fireworks. Many cities and counties like St. Charles only allow fireworks on specific days around the 4th of July. Just head over to the KMOV News app for a full list.